Hey guys, this is Nick from ReviewOutlaw.com. Today I want to show you how to buy IOTA. So this is um, a cryptocurrency coin, basically stands for Internet of Things. And the problem with this um, cryptocurrency is it's a little tough to get. You can't just go to like uh, Coinbase and buy it, um, and even some of the other exchanges um, it's a bit hard to get. So, so first thing you kind of want to do is learn a little bit more about these cryptocurrencies is go to CoinMarketCap and you can just check out all the coins. And right now it's, it's rated as number 10, about $10 million market cap. And the price is $3.94. Now the hope is of course that this price goes up. Um, and a couple neat things about IOTA is that there are no transaction fees. So like Bitcoin and pretty much almost all these other um, cryptocurrencies, as you transfer a coin, there's a fee to do that. And what's really unique about IOTA is there's no fees to transfer. They have their own protocol and they've kind of thought of that. Um, so, you know, if you send your friend $5, it's not gonna cost you $5 and one penny or whatever necessarily that would be. So into how we're gonna purchase this. First thing you need is Bitcoin. So if you don't have Bitcoin, this is kind of the father of all these different coins. And in order to get a lot of these other altcoins, you're gonna need Bitcoin. So to do that, I'd recommend setting up for a Coinbase account. You can use a credit card. You can use a um, bank account to transfer money. I'll put a link in the show notes um, to sign up. And if you sign up with that link, you get $10 free of Bitcoin once you transfer $100. So step one, get Bitcoin. If you uh, don't have a Coinbase account, another place, actually once you do get a Coinbase account, I recommend you move your coins off Coinbase and putting it onto like a desktop wallet. Um, or if you do leave it on Coinbase, make sure you set up two-factor authentication so if the place gets hacked. Um, but I prefer actually to get my coins either to a Ledger, Na Le Ledger Nano S or a desktop Exodus wallet. Either one of those two would be good. Make sure you back up your keys. A little side information there. All right, so you get your Bitcoin. You want to buy your IOTA now. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to just check out here um, where the different markets are. So a couple, the, the first place I try to get it was the number one place where it sold the most volume. Um, unfortunately, this website right now is not allowing any new customers. They're overloaded. So um, if I want to register right now, cannot do it. So that stinks. Then there's Bitfinex. Um, unfortunately, this one doesn't allow US customers. So as I go through, these get kind of complicated to sign up and stuff like that. The gate IO allows you to buy it, but you know you can't uh, transfer out of it. And I want to keep my coins in my own wallet so I have control. So if this place gets hacked, I'm not worried about it. Um, so the, what I found was this Coin Falcon is a pretty cool place. And they actually have pretty good rates right now compared to everyone else on the price of it, um, which is important to look at too, because you can look in here at these different prices. The prices fluctuate quite a bit. So you want to you know, try to get the lowest price, of course. Um, so what's neat about this place is you can sign up real quick and um, you can sign up real quick and, and basically transfer money. So first thing you want to do is you're going to deposit and you're going to deposit Bitcoin. So of course, create an account. Um, you know, create the account, do, do all the, st the stuff you need to do to get set up. Basically, email address, password, verify an email, and you're good. You don't have to give them IDs or anything like that. So you're going to deposit, <coughs> excuse me, you're going to deposit money into this address. And what I'd recommend doing first is to start off something small, like I did about $10. Um, and I deposited a Litecoin just because it was, the fees were a little bit less and converted it from Litecoin to Bitcoin. But either way, Bitcoin or Litecoin, just deposit cryptocurrency in here. And then you can buy and sell an IOTA. So you can basically, right here, this is the minimum amount you can buy and pay with Bitcoin and you buy it. So let me just go through the process right now and do that. Okay, as you can see, I'm um, starting the deposit and it's gonna be pending for a bit until this confirmation uh, confirms. So that might take about you know an hour maybe um, to, to confirm, depending on how backed up the Bitcoin network is. So while we wait, we're gonna want a wallet, and where we want to get that is just gonna uh, go to the IOTA's main website 
Um, you can just Google search IOTA, come right up. <clears throat> and then we can go, I should go there right now. So it's IOTA.org. It's a very fancy site. And on the very bottom, we can get our wallet. Started, download. Here we go. So um, basically, it's telling you you're going to need Java if you do a full node. I'm just going to do the light version. So you can download the release right here. Uh, I get Windows, I'm going to download the EXE. So I've already downloaded it <laughs> and installed it. And we have it right here. And basically, this is the login. So I've already logged in. Um, in order to create a login, what we're going to do. So what we're going to do is need to make a seed. And so this is an 81 character code and it has to be all kind of upper uh, uppercase capital letters, can't have numbers, can't have lowercase. It's kind of a pain here to, to get this. So in order to do this, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to create one. So the easiest thing is if you have LastPass to make this code, you go to LastPass, hit generate secure password. You're going to type find 81. 81 and then you hit advanced options uncheck these other things just uppercase control copy copy this and pop that in there and this is your verification code your C checksum so hit login there you go so now we have a new account with the zero balance and so what we can do is we can click receive you see this receive address we can highlight this and we can once we get the coins confirmed we can send that um, from this coin falcon here okay so we have the deposit now confirmed completed um, and as you can see we have the uh, money up here so what we're going to need to do now is transfer so click buy sell Use all. It's going to give me the total amount of biota that we get. I'm going to hit buy. Great. So now it's successful. And we get a few history. So it did drop the price just a little bit of my asset. Um, there's a slight fee. This is not from iota. This is actually from um, Coin Falcon. So now that this is confirmed, we want to withdraw the money into our personal account so to do that we're going to go in here we're going to hit receive highlight the receive address copy the clipboard great and we'll choose the coin Iota. and you could first what i do recommend doing first i've already done this but do a small amount like five and then withdraw those and as you can see, I've already done like 2.6 just to verify everything is working. Uh, so do a small amount first, make sure everything's working, and then you can do your full amount, <laughs> which is not going to be nine. Hit withdraw all and paste the address. And you always want to verify the last couple digits, ICD, and the first couple digits, NMY, NMY, ICD. Perfect. So got the amount, got everything in there. There is zero network fee, which is great. So there's zero fee to get this um, IOTA onto my personal wallet. So we're gonna withdraw this. And it's gonna see it in about one to two hours. What's great about this is, it, since it's my own wallet, it can't, it's not as likely to get hacked. My computer would have to get hacked and I have a strong security on my computer. Um, versus, you know, something like an exchange, which Coin Falcon is getting hacked is much more likely. So that's the why I prefer this method. So hopefully that uh, video was helpful on how to purchase IOTA um, using the Coin Falcon website. If you guys have any questions, feel free to let me know. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. If you have time, please subscribe to my channel, click here to watch more videos, or please give me a thumbs up. Thanks.